YouTube, I'm back again with another pickups video. I uh, just want to show you what I picked up from the charity shops over the last week. Um, as you can see, these uh, the two laser discs that uh, I got recently um, that were in my last uh, internet pickups video. Um, but anyway, I just thought I'd use them as a backdrop. Uh, so today, while I was out. Uh, for my lunch, uh, I had a quick look around the charity shops and I picked up for two quid Normal Wisdom Volume 1. Uh, comes with six discs and six movies, which are Bulldog Breed, One Good Turn, The Early Bird, Press for Time, On the Beat, and Man of the Moment. Uh, I do certainly remember On The Beat and The Early Bird, especially The Early Bird, I've seen uh, probably more than any other normal wisdom movie. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to checking these out again, it's uh, it's definitely been a while. Um, I did uh, grab one on VHS a few weeks ago, um, which, uh, was that the Square Peg I think it was called, but it's not on this set, it's, uh, there's a volume 2 and I think it's on, uh, it's on that set, but yeah. Really chuffed for that for just a couple of quid. And then this I picked up at the weekend. Um, the Star Wars set. This is the original trilogy. Um, this is the limited edition set that was uh, released. I, th I think it was a HMV uh, exclusive. There was two. There was this one and the prequel set. Which uh, this one's got Luke on the cover. The other one had Anakin. Uh, from episode three, I think. Um, whereas the standard release of these is to have the, uh, the lightsaber battle artwork on the front. Um, but this was for a charity shop pickup. I paid seven ninety nine. I don't think I've ever spent that much on a single item from a charity shop before. <laughs> uh, and anything else I wouldn't have done. But I know this is really, really rare, and it does. It does sell for, not mega box, but it does sell for a reasonable amount on eBay. And I was never going to pick one up off eBay. Um, so yeah, I'm really chuffed to have got this. It's, it's a little, uh, little doggy around the edges, but uh, still in pretty good condition. If I come across a nicer one in the future at some point for a reasonable price, I'll pick it up and sell this one on. But for now, yeah, I'm really chuffed to have grabbed this. And fortunately, they didn't have the other one. Um, I hope that uh, when I saw this, that whoever donated it might have had the uh, the other the Anakin box but they didn't um, and this is a devil to get in so if you just give me a moment okay and the magic of editing um, so this has a, a flap in the top which is really really difficult to get into especially one handed so I've opened it up uh, inside there's three slim cases um, three movies each one is a like the limited edition releases from the mid 2000s which I guess these came out the same time these but all two disc editions with uh, special and theatrical cuts of each of the movies okay, to this set and Even though it was a little bit more than I normally spend in a charity shop for 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 that particular item, um, I I think it was a bargain. I'm really happy to have uh, so got one of these. Um, that I've only seen maybe in the last three or four years. I think this is the third one of these I've seen. The last two were in CEX at uh, different times um, at twenty plus quid each. Um, which was too much more than I would want to pay for this set. Um, I know that it's a rare set, but uh, I'm a bargain hunter. I like to pick up a bargain, yeah, I'm, so I'm glad I got that. Uh, then these three came from British Red Cross, and they're still doing their three for a pound offer. Uh, so firstly, I picked up Green Lantern on DVD. Um, now I got this because 
last summer I picked up or was it this summer? No, it must have been this summer because I only got my 3D TV last autumn. So it must have been this summer I picked up a bunch of 3D movies from the car book sale. And one of them was Green Lantern on Blu-ray and 3D. Um, the DVD disc was missing. So for 33 pence, I thought, what the heck, I'll get this. And then I'll just shove this DVD in that box to complete that set uh, and also getting even with dad I've never seen this it's uh, Macaulay Culkin looks like it's maybe he's after home and only looks a little bit older on that cover so uh, yeah and this basically trade bait uh, for CX he's trading a couple of quid um, so for 33 pence to trade in for a couple of quid, more than happy to grab that. Uh, and then this last lot all came from uh, Age Concern, 49 pence each. Um, complete second season of Two and a Half Men. Complete first season of The Big Bang Theory. Wall Street, a limited edition, two disc edition. Uh, I've never actually seen this film, believe it or not. So, open it, we'll give that a try. Uh, a Schwarzenegger movie, a razor. Uh, two thousand and ten edition of Sunday for Sammy. I've never seen any of these, but uh, you always see you always see the adverts on the telly every year. Um, and it always looks quite funny, so uh, yeah, I've uh, never ever come across one of these second hand, so 49p, I'll give it a go. And finally, again, 49p, uh, Live Forever, The Rise and Fall of Britpop. Um, I'm guessing this is a some kind of documentary from uh, back in the 90s when all these bands were uh, huge. wasn't really my thing, it definitely wasn't there. An Oasis fan. I didn't mind a, a few of the songs that Blur put out, but for the most part, Britpop didn't didn't appeal to me at all. But uh, nostalgic, look, I suppose. Um, but I'll give it a try. That's it. That's all my charity shop pickups over the last week. Uh, not an awful lot, but uh, a few. I'm trying to cut down. Um, although I do have. At least two more pre-orders this month and there's a couple of items a couple of films from uh, 88 films indiegogo project from the summer but they're already paid for so that's not a problem um but it's black friday in a few weeks so i want to save as much money as i can so i'm gonna hopefully between now and then uh curb any Certainly charity shop, um, Amazon, eBay. That said, I think I've got at least two items I've ordered off eBay over the last couple of days, but they're all really, really cheap. You know, a couple of quid items. Um, so, again, I've paid for them now. Um, but I'll try, unless it's something really, really special that I can't do without. Um... I'm going to try and not spend any more money between now and uh, Black Friday. Because i got some really good deals off Amazon last Black Friday. Anyway, I'm rambling once again. Uh, so that's it. Thanks very much for watching. And uh, it might be now the end of the month before my next video. But we'll see. So thanks for watching. Ta